Hi all and welcome to another video. In this video I will show you how to replace the HDD or upgrade to an SSD on the PS3. For this you will need a cross screwdriver, a thumb drive and a computer or laptop that is connected to the internet. We start by taking out the one screw under the plastic cover. You can lift this cover by using your nail or something flat. When the screw is out, you can slide the plastic cover away. And there should be the HDD. You can pull it out by the bracket itself. Once out, there are four screws to be taken out. As you can see, I already did an upgrade to an SSD before this video. Replace the old HDD with a new HDD or SSD put back the four screws Then put the HDD or SSD with bracket in a PS3. Slide the cover back in place and put in the last screw. When the screw is in, you can click back the cover. So far for the hardware part, now the software part. We need to prepare the thumb drive on a PC or laptop. Start by formatting it in FAT32. Right click the thumb drive and select Format. Then if everything looks like what is on my screen, you can select start. Then go to a browser and google for PS3 update file. For some reason the file on the Sony website wouldn't download for me. But there are plenty of other sites that also have this file. The file needs to be put in an update map and, the map and that map needs to be in the PS3 map on your thumb drive. So we need to make those as well. When the file is on your thumb drive, you can uh, safely remove this drive and then we can start the rest of the process. Connect everything back up on the PS3. Connect the controller using the USB cable to charge it. 
put in the thumb drive you just made with the update file on it, then start the PS3. The screen will tell you what to do. You have to press select and start. Then it will check everything and tell you to press select and start for five seconds. After the installation process will begin. It will format the HDD or SDD you put in and then copy the files. When all is said and done, it will restart and you will have to walk to the configuration process of the PS3. And that's it. It will take you about 15 minutes or so depending on your skill. And if you're using an HDD or SDD. Thank you for watching this video until the end, drop a like if you liked the video and subscribe for more content like this. Goodbye and like we say in the Netherlands, tot ziens.